everyone. Happy, Happy Tuesday, Tuesday Boot Camp Day. Party and party and yeah. Party and party and yeah. Fun, fun. We should Thanks always start this you way. You know hey, what hey, it hey, is. Y'all, hey. welcome, welcome, welcome. We're so excited to have you here. This yes. is Maker Boot Camp. If you have no idea what you have found, or if you have ventured <laughs> here and you're like brand new, happy boot camp day. Welcome. You, chances are if you're here, you signed up for boot camp, which is such a blessing. Yeah. And you get a full five day experience with the Makers Gonna Learn team teaching you how to make some amazing creative projects. Oh my gosh, and this is just day two. So just we've day got, two. after today, we've got three more days of yeah. crafting with you all. It is so it's fun. so much fun. Here's what I want you guys to do. If for some reason you've stumbled here and you're not registered for boot camp, my girl Sadie is gonna drop you the link. It's the little camping emojis, oh. and she's gonna drop you the link. All you need to do for your name and your email you are gonna be entered for boot camp. All right. Ooh. Go ahead, grab your supply list. Yes. And Alicia, you're getting all of the files, all the fonts for the whole week. Yep, for free. For free. Because we love you guys. Yay, it's so I love fun. It. The one time a year yep. that we give away all the files, all the supply list, everything for free. Yep. Not just to our members, but to our friends of the show too. Mm -hmm. This is National Craft Month. We go big. We always go big. Always go big. Always go big in March. So good. March yeah. has been so good for us, y'all. I yeah. am so, so excited. If you in any form, fashion have been able to claim your very own craft hack handbook alicia congratulations congratulations we are so excited <laughs> over a thousand of you over 12 uh, i think we had 200 mm -hmm. and over a thousand so we ordered roughly 1200 yeah um there's 150 ish left yeah. we had a ton of you claim a spot like at this rate they're gonna be gone before the end of the week no doubt so here's what you need to do if you want to grab a year membership at makers gonna learn mm -hmm. 75 dollars off our black friday discount that is available and you're claiming a free book on top of the course portal. Yes. So our team has taken 170-ish. Yeah. We say 150 in the book, it's actually 170. There's a lot. <laughs> 170 craft hacks. This course and book is worth $197. Yeah. We're giving it to y'all for free. Y'all, there is a Ooh. hack, every hack that Tanner was just talking about, oh, there is a video for every single hack in this yeah. book. And that's why we're calling it a course because yeah. you all can spend days and days and days looking 12, at these hacks. Yeah, 12 top categories. Yes. It's incredible. So all you need to do is grab a year membership. If you're already a year member, you have so many options. Yes, oh my gosh. You can grab a Makeathon ticket. Mm -hmm. You can grab the Craft Tech Handbook at 50% off. Yep. You can add a year of membership. All you need to do is go to makersgonnalearn.com forward slash hacks and we will hook you up with the other opportunities. Essentially anything over $97, you're getting a free $200 course. Yes. Which is crazy. I mean, it's like a two for one. Yeah, we've so. given you a ton of deals, so go make your decision. I just wanna get you this book in your hands this week because so this course is gonna be selling at $200. We don't want you to miss out. I wanna right. give it to you completely free and the books are in. Yeah, and so, you guys are gonna ooh. be the first people to get your hands on these books, yes. which is incredible. We are, this is our first time. Yeah, um, we're published as, authors. We're published authors. I like, I'm like, put it on my resume. Yeah. Um, so we worked really hard on this, and y'all, you do not want to miss all these hacks. It's yes. like, we just took every ounce of crafting knowledge that we had yes. with the Cricut, and y'all, there's Cricut, there's general crafting, there's Dollar so Tree good. crafting, so, so lots good. of good information. It's yeah. Very exciting. So it's super exciting. I have a giveaway winner from yesterday we have another giveaway today for Yay. day two of boot camp what we want you guys to do is to make alongside us craft alongside us if you're a newbie you are in the right place my friend we are going to take such great care of you today you have a Alicia with us for Yay. day two so much fun she is going to be teaching you a how to you dabble with resin. We're dabbling in some resin today. Love it. But there's an option if you don't even, if you're like, resin is not for me, I think yes. be open because you may fall in love with it. I think so too. It's I think really... you guys, if you haven't done resin, I think this is a good, 
Um, gateway. Yeah. We're gonna call this the gateway drug into resin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> um, it's just it's very simple, but we did do an alternative for those yes. of you all who were not interested in doing that. Right. Or if you've done it and you're like, eh, it's not for me. Yeah. So, so it's gonna be you're gonna dabble with resin. She has so many tips and tricks for you today. Mm -hmm. You're gonna learn working with a, a, a font. Yes. So good. This is our first font project of boot camp, and a lot yep. of you have questions about fonts and how the relationship to fonts work with design space. Oh, yeah. And, and you know I can talk about that for ages. It's yes. like my favorite thing to talk about yes. is fonts. Fonts are one of the biggest things at Maker's Gonna Learn. Mm -hmm. So if you're considering membership this week, what I want you to consider is not only our 30-day challenge workbook, you know, the course that you get the 30 videos. What I also want you to consider is the over 20,000 cut files and the crazy. over a thousand fonts. I mean, it's crazy. Instant access. We just put a huge emphasis on search on our website. Mm -hmm. So please, as you're learning search, as you're using search over there, if you see anything come up that's wonky or that you want us to look into, I would love your feedback for Absolutely. our friends of the show that are members. Yeah, It's improving substantially. So we're right. super excited about that. We are constantly putting resources to bettering the platform, which we mm -hmm. just love. And y'all, we read through your comments. We yeah. read through, if you all have suggestions or cut file requests, like yes. we genuinely want to hear what you all want. And all the projects that we pick are typically related to something that you asked for. Yeah, totally. So we're always listening to you all. Yes. Don't feel like there's so many of you that we, you get lost in it. No, we see yeah, it. It's awesome. Yeah. So what I want you guys to do is just get ready. It's going to be an amazing project. Today we are giving away a hundred dollar <gasps> Amazon gift card Ooh. so that a special winner can go maybe pick up Bob some resin done. supplies. All of this is on Amazon. Yep. Can we talk about, someone says they have asthma. I also am an asthmatic here. Yes. I have worked with resin and I will say my asthma is mild. Yeah. So it's, it's not like the bait lowest. Like it's not like, I will say it's mild. Yeah. I carry a rescue inhaler very infrequent. Do I have asthma attacks? Right. But it is, I am known to have them. Mm -hmm. The smell here is not, with the type of resin we're gonna work with today, I don't think is the, no. it's not bad. It's not, um, if you've ever worked with casting resin, casting yes. resin's very distinct smell, and it'll sting at the whole room. And casting, in. let's think of casting as that part A, part B. Yes, yeah, a two that part chemical, resin. Yeah, two part resin. And the chemical reaction is what causes that smell. Yes. But y'all, this uh, is UV resin, which is what we're using today. It's much more user yes. friendly. You don't have to mix equal parts, yeah. it's already mixed. I so. would say, if nail polish does not bother you, this would I not agree. bother you. That's a perfect way to like put it. Like nail polish, yeah. for the most part, doesn't have that much of a smell. Yeah, but it does have like but it something. Has a, it has something. Yeah. And as well as the resin, it has something, but it's not to the caliber. Right. And I will also say, having two-part resin is like having a, another child. <laughs> like you have to babysit it. It takes you hours of cure. Yeah. You're not going to experience that with the resin that we are going to hook you up with today. Mm -hmm. It's like having your cake and getting to eat it too. Yes, we love it that. It is really, really neat. So we're super, super excited for Yay. you. You're going to learn working with fonts that Maker is going to learn. When you're an active member, you get a commercial use license. Yes. So you get to make money with your Cricut mm -hmm. while you're a member. So you could make these and sell them. Right. Which a lot of people do. And that's what... That was, the, even when we made this, we were just talking about how yes. big of a seller this is on Etsy right now. Y'all know the Stanley Cup craze is something that's yeah. huge. And maybe Stanley's are not your thing, but listen, if you're trying to make some money crafting, it doesn't have to be your thing. Right. This can be something that you can sell because you know that that's where the money is. Yeah. If you know that's where the money is, that's what you should be crafting and creating. Yeah, totally. And honestly, they're so fun to make and so, so fun, fun to customize. You can offer the different colors and things like that. Yep. And we actually purchased some of our blanks from an Etsy seller that does laser made projects. Yeah. So um, it's, it's very cool. Really, yeah. It's going to be a really fun project. This is one that you're going to have to make. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who has already made day one's project. Oh we love, love, love seeing it. I mean, it as soon so as we good. go off air, they're people already, already on. they're already on the group. It's crazy. So yeah. when you're a member, you get the member only Facebook group. Mm -hmm. It is the place to be. And honestly, at night, I have been just enjoying reading everyone's Facebook posts, looking at everything. It's yes. been so epic. So please post what you're working on this week, even if it's not 
want uh, or it. craft or anything like that. So yeah. we are so thrilled to have you. Let's go ahead and announce the giveaway winner from yesterday. Let's do it. Taking home the $100 Celebration Warehouse gift card. Drum roll, please. Drum roll. Congratulations, Roxanne Graham. Yay, Yay. Yay. Roxanne. Roxanne, all you need to do is email us, hi at makersgonnalearn.com with yep. your best uh, email address so that we can hook you up with that gift card from Celebration Warehouse. Treat yourself to an amazing amount of paper from our friends at Celebration Warehouse. Oh my gosh. We love hooking You're you guys love up. It. it is gonna be super, super fun. So yes. today we're picking someone at random mm -hmm. to win the $100 Amazon gift card. Yep. All right. Super, super fun. We love, love, love seeing it. Congrats. Yes, congrats oh, to Oh, everyone's so nice. I love it, I love it, I love it. So good. So again, while you're crafting along, as you see the fonts, you know, as you see all the benefits of membership, maybe you'll show them the dashboard later at yeah, the end of the show. Of course. Just for the new members. We had almost, you know, 50 new yearly members join. Crazy. Oh, that's crazy. Welcome, guys. welcome, welcome, oh everyone. Um, you'll see how to use the dashboard, yeah. why fonts are so important. It's really good to have the education for die cutting, and that's what you get in our platform. Yeah. 53 cents a day. You're getting grandfathered in at yep. our lowest price available. You're locked in, everybody. We brought our best deal here for mm -hmm. you, plus the Craft Tech Handbook, so that you, this is a no-brainer. Right. So don't right, walk, right. run over, register. What I'm gonna do is if you register on air today, I'm gonna give you a shout out, I'm gonna put your name on your book, and Ooh. who knows, maybe you'll get an extra little surprise. You have okay. no idea what Tanner may be doing when you enroll along with us. It. So it's so good. So, <laughs> Grab your membership. Are you ready to get crafty? Let's do it. Let's get crafty. Let's okay. go over these supplies. Let's... These supplies are epic. Yes. So if you don't know what a Stanley Cup is, here's Tanner's. He had it on the show yesterday. I mean, I saw you guys comparing I did. cardstock to the color. This Stanley, just to give it a shout out, I saw this drop from Target, and this is the Joanna Gaines. Is it? I didn't know she had one. She has two or three colors, and okay. it's beautiful. All Listen, right. I just want you all to know that I'm late to the party. I know, like, Farmhouse is kind of, like, making its way out, but I just started watching the Chip and Joanna <gasps> show, Fixer Upper, Ooh. Um, and I'm obsessed. I watch it. It's my comfort show. I don't really watch TV, so, like, when I turn it on, that's what I watch. Listen, when you have kids, you have to have, a like, like some something. reality TV. Yeah. Oh, I have been watching Love is Blind. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> so there's that. Um, anyway, so we are gonna be making the toppers for these. Now let's do overhead. I'm gonna show you all the two different versions that we're gonna be making today. So I've got these two right here. Can y'all see those really good? Beautiful. Up a little bit more. They look good. so good. Okay, this is our resin one, and then this is one that we purchased from an Etsy seller, and I'm hoping this Etsy seller blows up because of you all. Yes. Uh, I feel like that would be a really fun day for them. <laughs> so we are going to be, I'm going to show you all how to use resin, how to put the flowers in there, and then how to apply vinyl and then seal that resin in if you want to. So these are just super fun. Um, we have different options here. So these are just some that we, this is one we played around with. We did some gold flake. This one we purchased and it already had, actually they gave us this one. I think the part, the people we purchased from gave us like a freebie. So sweet. And then we got these two colors. So this is like a translucent or iridescent type of color. And then we have a gray one here. So all of the links to the supplies that we used are on the supply link page, yes. which was emailed to you all. If you're a member, it was emailed to you. If you signed up with your, signed up with your email, it was emailed to you as well, yes. but I want to show you now, all what that looks like. If for some reason you did not get it, feel free to re-register yes. and get it. If you have not registered, register. You get a super secret deal on that thank you page. So yes. if you're not a member, you can check that out as well um, to get started and make your decision towards membership. It's a little trial offer for a yeah. dollar. If you've taken that offer, but you haven't committed to a year, I highly recommend upgrading during this promotion. Use the coupon code 75OFF. Mm -hmm. I'd link below. Love okay, it. Love it. So let's go to share screen. I want to show you all. This is the close up of the project actually on the Stanley Cup. How beautiful is that? I love to personalize things. I think that's why I love crafting so much. Um, I just love something that just says, oh, that's definitely like Sadie's cup. That looks like yes. a Sadie cup. So all the supplies you're going to need are here. Um, right underneath, we've got our font. You're gonna need resin, the light, everything is here. I saw a couple of you asking 
which Etsy shop that we use. I'm just gonna click on this Etsy shop Open to show you up. all. Shout out. Oh look, we have this one right here. Wait, got is that. it, how much is this? Okay, so let's just, you've gotta pick depending on your size. So make sure that you guys know the measurements of yours. And I think we have the 40 ounce curved and it should be on the bottom. Yours has a sticker and I'm wondering uh, if it's covered. Let me try to see what I can do over here. So, and then once you select that, you can get like, look, you can get a clear pack of 15 oh for $13. $13? Yes. What? So that's less than a dollar per thing. And then you can Alicia. sell them for what? Like seven, $8 yeah. uh, I, easily? 12. 12? I mean, you're, think about how much you're investing in this Stanley. Right, right. I mean, this so, is... Look, Necessary. they've got all these right here. You can get packs of multiples mm -hmm. and it has all the colors listed here. So they've done all this and you can see the difference between the 20 and 30 ounce versus the 40 yeah. ounce. Um, if you've registered and you haven't received your email for supplies, you can re-register. Or you can or, email customer support, mm -hmm. hi at makersgonnalearn.com. Yes. We have a large group crafting of this this week. A and huge. even when we don't have a large group, we always have a group. Yes. And here on the show, it's just not the best customer care. So right. you need to take all of those concerns and go straight to hi at makersgonnalearn.com. Mm -hmm. We pay a full team to run customer care. I just wanted to show overhead of the what that's this gonna right look here. like. Yeah, I kind of scraped some of it off. Where's the best place to buy Stanley, Jeannie? I think um, Dick Sporting Goods has been doing really good. Target has them. They Target sell out now. They do sell out, but Dick Sporting Goods have had quite a few in. If you, you like know? a knockoff, you can go on on uh, Timu. And Timu. and Timu. They have knockoff ones. Timus are like fourteen dollars. We have some back do in the Do you want to know room. a secret? Yes. So I was very late to the. Um, Stanley game. Me too. Very late. I was later. I you. saw a different color of this tan. Yeah. And I was like, oh, this is gonna be my. Courtney got one as a gift, and I just started drinking out of it so much. <laughs> and once I saw a similar color to this, I was like, I have to get it. Yeah. It was sold out everywhere. I had to get it on eBay. Stop. I may have overpaid. By I'm sure a little you bit, did a lot. But it was so fun and I love it. <laughs> it's like a game. I love guys. it. It's a game. Sadie is going to drop you the link to register for boot camp. It's yeah. the little camping emojis. I love it. I love it. So, so you're creative. at boot camp. You're going to get crafty with us. So good. Sorry to take your show oh, away. Sacred Space Crafts. Dollar Tree has knockoff Stanleys. Me and Lauren saw them at the Dollar Tree last Thursday in Knoxville. Oh. Yeah. They're So they're plastic inside. Um, but they look like Stanley's and they also have them at five below and they have the most adorable patterns like daisies so and fun. lightning bolts. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. So anyways, side tangent, let's go back to the share screen. Um, I just want to show you all, a lot of people aren't familiar with how to shop on Etsy. So if, right. you, if you follow this link, it's going to take you exactly here where we're at. So you're going to want to pick your size, mm -hmm. okay? Check the bottom of your cup, depending on your size. And then you're going to select your color and quantity and so it looks like this seller mainly sells in bulk but they have these options right here so let's say that we wanted to get one of these um let's go over here and look at the solids so let's say we wanted this hot pink i'm going to go to select an option and we're going to it says solids yeah so i'm going to do one i'm assuming it's color they don't have one solids one color and then right here it says add your personalization and then it tells you, it says, these aren't personalizable, they're blank. So you're just ordering a blank tag from these people. And you're going to hit type in hot pink, and then you would just add it to your cart. Okay. And this shop name is BBJ Craft House. Okay. They've got five stars, which is amazing. Um, and lots of the, the 40 ounce Stanley is a popular size. Christine was asking about the mold. So that's how you would order a blank. Okay. Now. If you're wanting to do these out of resin, we're going to go back to the supply page and I'm gonna show you all how you would get the uh, resin mold. Okay, this is also an Etsy seller. Okay, so we're gonna click on this mold right here and it's gonna take us to Etsy. And this one, so the mold is a little bit more expensive, but you've gotta think, you can use this over and over and over again. This right. is laser cut acrylic. The blanks are laser cut acrylic. This is just a silicone mold that we would add to cart. Make sure you're reading the description over here. There are so many things in the description that can be easily missed. You can hit learn about more. Look, creates a 40 ounce tag. 
Okay, make sure you're reading the measurements. Make sure you're reading everything over here so you're not ordering the wrong thing, okay? So this shop has lots of other molds that are super cute. And look, they've even got like the Stanley flower topper. I'm obsessed with this. So I need good. to order that actually, that's so yeah. cute. And so this one would fit a Stanley cup as well, but you wanna double check that it fits the size. This one fits the new H 2.0 Stanley, whatever that is. <laughs> so you just wanna really verify. Okay, so let's go overhead and we'll go over all of the supplies you're gonna need to recreate these. Now, if you're not doing a resin one and you're just doing this one right here, if you just wanna buy a blank and add vinyl to them, which is honestly gonna be your cheapest investment, um, so you're gonna get the biggest return on, like your profits are gonna be higher, I would just get some pretty blanks, start out with just a few, don't get crazy, you don't wanna have a ton of stock on hand all the time, you wanna kinda just, have some, see what people want, see what people like about them, and then you can order more as you go. Yeah. Um, and you're only gonna need the topper and then some permanent adhesive vinyl. Now we're using StarCraft. We are gonna be doing dainty cuts, so I recommend a high quality vinyl. StarCraft is it for us. Love it. I mean, they're like the end all be all. They're so good. If you have Oracle 651, 10 out of 10 recommend them as well. Um, but this is adhesive vinyl. This is not HTV. Okay, so we're gonna actually be cutting this. We're gonna have to weed it and then transfer it on with transfer tape. Okay, so that's adhesive vinyl. And then I've got some Caesar transfer tape here. I personally love this brand. You can use whatever you've got on hand. So for those, that's it. Now, if you're wanting to make the resin ones, we're gonna be creating, recreating this dried flower one. I'm gonna get these out of the way. So you're gonna need the mold that I just showed you off Etsy, and then you're gonna need some resin. Now this resin is the J Diction. I've got two bottles of it in here. We usually buy it in bulk and then transfer it in these small bottles so it's easier to handle. Um, but this is just off of Amazon. This is not a two-part resin. So it's literally, you just need the bottle, just one singular bottle and that's it, and you need a UV light. So we've got this UV light here, and this is, I wanna say, it says 85 volt to 265 volt. I wanna say it's a 10 watt. It's it, really good. Yeah, it's really good. We've linked the one that we used. Um, these are like really good, but honestly, if you live in a sunny place and the sun is shining, go outside. Yes. UV resin cures in the sun almost instantly like yeah. maybe a minute <coughs> excuse me so you're going to need that and then you're going to need some tools to help you maneuver the resin so we've got a blowtorch here i don't know if you call this a blowtorch it's, it's like, like a, a mini blowtorch <laughs> <laughs> You can find this at the gas station near the illegal paraphernalia. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm just I'm just saying, you can find them at gas stations, like yeah. everywhere. So um, you're gonna need that. I mean, it literally just puts out a little, it's like right. a butane lighter. I and, really think there's, with all this considering, considering resin is its own genre mm -hmm. of crafting, when you consider that, for sure. you're really not needing that many supplies. Especially if you've like already played around with resin and right. you've already got like You already have stuff. the blowtorch or the, you right. know, the different things. So it's really good. Right. Can this cause any risk for health while you while using it while drinking? Uh, so it's not actually touching your straw. It's actually not participating in any of the um, food interaction. The food interaction. Yeah, it doesn't and you can anything. demonstrate with my cup at any point yeah. later. So okay, yay, it's totally. so good. Such a great question. Um, so Kelsey asks, is it actually a blowtorch or a heat gun? It's not a heat gun. It actually has a flame coming out of it. Yes. You can use a heat gun though. Yes. We just like to use the flame is quicker and it just zaps it out. So and I'm gonna yeah. show you all how to use that in a minute. Um, I've got some popsicle sticks. These are always good to have on hand when working with resin. So you can kind of move the resin around. Um, there's some rubbing alcohol. I've got a brayer just to put my vinyl on. Sandpaper, I'm gonna show you guys how to use that. And then I've got some gloves. You're gonna want to wear PPE any time that you're working with resin, wear the proper PPE that you are comfortable with. We typically wear gloves. If you're not in a well-ventilated area, you can wear a mask. Read the back of the bottle. Whatever the back of the bottle says is what yeah. you should do. Okay, um, and then I've got a standard grip mats. Yes. All right. That's everything. Easy enough, right? 
Okay, so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna start with the basics. So we're just gonna start with the plain Stanley topper that we ordered off Etsy that has nothing on it. We're not gonna be doing the resin yet. We're just gonna start simple, okay? And I'm gonna show you all kind of how to lay it out in design space and add your words and things like that. So what we're gonna need to do is grab one of our blanks to start. Now I wanna talk about this glitter one versus this gray one. Okay. Um, what is important about these is that you need to pay attention to the colors of vinyl that you're selecting whenever you go, is that in the center, Sadie? Um, you need to pay attention to like the colors that you're choosing when you're working with different blanks. Like we're not gonna wanna use white or pink or yellow on this cause it's gonna disappear. Mm -hmm. But like over here on this gray one, we can pretty much do any color except for totally. gray. It's gonna show up. So those are things you wanna think about when you're working with different blanks. But for design space purposes, we're gonna want to measure this. Now, this is similar to like a rectangle shape. So I'm gonna measure this whole thing right here. This is given like three and a quarter, okay, mm -hmm. by one and a quarter. Okay, so let's go in to design space. So three and a quarter by one and a quarter. So good. Yesterday's project set. Did you guys make yesterday's project? Ooh, it's amazing. Yesterday's project was absolutely so much fun. It's so good. If you missed it, you need to go back and yeah, watch it. Yeah, watch the so replay. Good. Sign up for boot camp. Get it while you, get it while the getting's good. Get it while the getting's good, everybody. Okay, so I just went to shapes, select a square, and then when it comes in, you're gonna unlock your shape change your width to 3.25, and then change your height to 1.25. And let's just zoom on in here, okay? Now, there's obviously a hole here. So let's measure how far down that hole goes from the edge. It goes down almost like three quarters of an inch, maybe more like half an inch. So I'm just gonna add a circle. This is just strictly for design purposes. Um, I'm going to make this like, I don't know, 0.25, maybe bigger than that, y'all. And you're going in depth. Like sometimes I wouldn't even go. Sometimes people don't. Yeah. Sometimes people don't, but I just, this is such a weird shape blank. Right, I right, just right, wanna right. make sure that we are like doing it correctly. So you can do it with or without the hole. <laughs> if you're like, that's too difficult for me, you can always just measure from the edge of this hole right here, like this edge right here, to the end of the blank. I think that'd be yes. easier. Let's just do that. So we're gonna do mm, two and a half inches, okay? So instead of doing the circle and stuff, just to make it easier, we're gonna change the width of this to 2.5. Does that make sense to everybody? Yes. So now we know we can fill up this whole space and it's Smart. gonna See, be that's, fine. This is what I like to do. Yeah, yeah this is, that's easier. I so like I'm, to make the shape the size of my safe zone. A, like yes, I call it, I call that's that such like a good my way safe to put zone. It. Right, right. That's your, you know that no matter how big you make your vinyl here, right. it's gonna fit perfectly. Exactly. So we have this two and a half by 1.25 safe zone. I call this my, also I consider it like, it's just, this is, you're getting the most for the least amount of time investment. Right. Right? Like, Alicia can walk you through exactly how to recreate it and build your own, like, if you want needed right. to. It's just not but required. But do you need to? Yeah, it's right. just not required, which exactly. is so fun. So, what I'm going to do is select it, and we're going to change this to the color of the blank. So, we'll start with the gray one, and then I'm going to just duplicate it, and we can change this one to either pink, yellow, or white. Yes. Um, just to kind of get a vibe for this, the glittery one. And then what we're going to do is we're going to need to download our font. So if you haven't already downloaded your font, you're just going to need to go to that supply page. And we're going to be using the Celine font. So let's mm. go back up here. This font is one of our newer fonts. It's beautiful, gorgeous. So good. And you're gonna find this on the website. If you wanna use a different font, feel free. And we're gonna hit download. That's gonna pop up here into our zip folder. We're gonna click that. And then it's gonna unzip the folder. Mm -hmm. And then now here, we're gonna double click on that Celine.otf font. Ooh. Okay, and then you're gonna hit install. 
Okay. Love it. It's now on our computer. But in design space, we're gonna need to go back. So I'm gonna go down here and click on design space. And before I do anything, I'm gonna save my project. So go up to the top right and hit save. And we're gonna title this Stanley Toppers. I'm gonna save this to my project, Stanlet, Stanlet Toppers. And Same then time. hit save. And then in order to get that font into design space, we're gonna go up here to view and reload. Yay. And then now when we go search for Celine, it's gonna be there. Mm -hmm. It'll be right there. So I'm gonna zoom back in. And if I'm ever too far away, y'all get on to me. <laughs> I work from far away. Yes. It's just a habit. Okay. Beth so. says I literally looked through every single font last night for the perfect one. Oh, yes, I love Beth, it. love it. Beth, we're soul sisters. I do the same thing. I'll look for fonts for ages. It's a bad habit. Okay. Or a good habit. I don't know. Okay, so my text box kind of went down there to the bottom. I'm gonna zoom back in. And then now we can change the wording to whatever we want. So I want to say this gray one is for Courtney. Ooh. Oh, cool. let me fix how I'm spelling Now listen, y'all, this Celine font, don't walk, run, download it. And here's yes. what I want to say. There are so many of you that are joining the membership today. Yes, it's crazy. I just want to say thank you so much. There's so much great energy that I have went ahead. I'm informing the team. As of right now, I'm informing the team. We are putting a special secret gift in <gasps> if you sign up for your year membership by three o'clock today. Yeah. People that have enrolled today up until three o'clock, I feel like there's quite a few of you that mm -hmm. have been here and you're like, oh my gosh, like I've seen so many of you. I just want to give a few shout outs. Like yeah. shout out to Jasmine, shout out to um, pa Paige, uh, shout out to Karen, shout out to Carrie, Mary, Diane. I am so excited to not Yay. only get you a year membership, get in your Craft Hack handbook mailed to you using that coupon code 750FF, but when you sign up, you're getting a special gift added to the shipment of your craft hack handbook, but you must register by three o'clock today. Yes. All right. So if you're on the fence, you just seen how easy it is to work with our fonts. Don't walk, run over, get in there. And to my team, I'll inform you on what the secret is right now on Slack. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Donna so says fun. you make me want to sign up again. Donna. <laughs> You're such a great friend of the show. I hope I you're feeling better as well. We love you, Donna. We yes. talk about you all the time. We, yes. You're such a good so support. So fun. Okay, so I've got my Courtney typed out what I want. Um, now let's change this font, okay? We're going to keep your font selected so you'll know it's selected if you have this bounding box, okay? And then we're going to go up here to this font drop down menu. So I'm going to select right here. And when you initially open it, it may be right here, but you all, you can move this around so it's out of the way of where you're working, which is amazing that Cricut has done this for us. And so what we're gonna do next is go to our system fonts because Cricut fonts are from Cricut. Yes. System fonts are in our system. So I'm gonna go here and let's type in the name of our font. So we're gonna be using Celine. I think this name is really long, so I'm gonna show you, tell you guys what I think about it. We're gonna select it right here, and look, you can see that Courtney changes right away. Now, what I'm gonna do is resize Courtney down. Make sure your font is locked. If your lock looks like that, and you go in and start doing this with your font, just have me in the back of your brain saying, no, don't do that. Cause I, it just makes your fonts look really crazy. So make sure it looks like this up here, and then resize. Now. In order for Courtney's name to fit on here, let's look at the measurements of this. Look up here. It's 2.1 by 0 0.6 in height, you guys. 0 0.6. We're working with adhesive vinyl. Now, if we were working with HTV and we were applying a heat transfer vinyl that already has that built-in carrier sheet, we could totally cut this out and I would be like, mm, no problem. But since we're working with adhesive vinyl, what happens is we go to weed these, like the little inside of the O or the inside of the E, and it starts to pull up what we cut out and it ruins our vinyl. Now we're working with the best vinyl that there is. So we may not have issues, but what I'm gonna do is cut out one with the font that we want, and I'm gonna pick another font that I think is a safer choice, and mm -hmm. we're gonna cut that one out too. Because I really, I'm worried that that's gonna mess up. 
and it's because Courtney's name's so long. If I wanted to really like, if I wanted to make it fit, I could change it to Court. And look, we can size it up. And honestly, that would probably cut perfect. Love it. So we could do that if you guys want. Um, and then what, that's like the main thing. You wanna be thinking about fonts and what type of material you're using. So adhesive vinyl, it's not as easy to weed as HTV. So just something to think about. So I'm actually just gonna keep it at court cause that's cute, that's what we call her. <laughs> <laughs> and then for the glitter one, I saw somebody leave a comment, if this was you, I forgot who said it, but they were talking about on the glitter font that we should use a bolder font because it's going to show up better. And that's such a great point. And you can also stack vinyl so it pops off a little bit more. So let's just pull up a text box. Why my text box? There, there it is. And we're going to add a name here. Okay. Let's do, oh, we don't want to put your name on the glitter one, do we? <laughs> um, let's just do Lauren's name. Okay. So fun. And then we can shrink this down. Now, I want to use a different font because the glitter, you're going to really want to pick something that's bold. And so this pink one is for our glitter one. So you can use a font that you've already got downloaded. If you're a member, you can get another font. That's a perk to being a member. You're gonna be able to just go onto the website and pick right. out whatever font you want. Um, something like chiffon would be show up really well. That's really fun for that glitter. Or you could do something like um, Fabulosity is really cute. Super retro. So that's a good option, but you just want to think about your blanks, your colors, and all of the things like that. So good. Yeah, and I actually think I like chiffon. We're just going to stick with that. I think that's really fun. <gasps> I love the chunky font. Me too. We actually use this one. No, we use juniper. Juniper mm -hmm. is very similar to this on the Easter egg. The Easter egg is, so, y'all, can we just talk about, I know, so here at Bootcamp, we try to do like projects that you could make year-round um, that not seasonal but like y'all did an amazing project mm -hmm. last week yes it was epic and you everybody's been recreating yeah, you them. must go rewatch it it's so cute so fun so um we're gonna have lauren's here and i think i'm going to stack these so we're gonna do like two layers now someone just asked can design space designs be used on the juliet no you can't export designs you make in design space but we are teaching an amazing secret class mm -hmm. this Sunday for boot campers. And you do not want to miss this, y'all. It is a super secret class. You must be there live. You have to. There is literally urgency that I cannot wait to share with you this training. And then I cannot wait to share with you the secret surprise. It's at 8 p.m. this Sunday. If you're registered for boot camp, you are already enrolled. Yeah. Um, so another reason to be registered for boot camp. I love it. So good. Okay, so we've got some light pink in here and we've got some white. I'm gonna actually change Lauren's to this darker pink. Okay, so here we go. Now all we need to do is hide these. Now if you're doing multiples of the same project, don't delete your squares because we've already measured these out. You know, it makes it right. a lot easier when you go to cut it and stuff. So what I'm gonna do next, we've got everything here that we need to cut. Everything is sized correctly. That's, you really wanna make sure you size everything and we've hidden our squares. The next thing we're gonna do is go to make it and then we would just cut these out. Now I can put all of these on the same mat. So I've got Lauren here. I'm going to click on this next mat. I'm gonna hit the three dots up here in this left corner, okay? Hit that and we're gonna select move object. And then we're gonna select this white mat. We're gonna cut all these at once because we're do it's so small, it would be crazy for us not to, okay? Right. I'm just gonna put this down here at the five inch mark. We're gonna select our third mat. I'm gonna hit those three dots, hit move object and mm -hmm. hit the white mat again. And then we're just gonna put this down here at the 10 mark. And look, we can cut all of these at once. So let's go over ahead and put our vinyl on our mat. So fun. Love it. So we can put, we're gonna do Courtney in light pink. So if we go back to the share screen, you can see Courtney is up on the top left. 
Love it. Okay, so we're putting the color we want for Courtney in the top left. And then we've got one of the Laurens is at the five mark. So I'm gonna lay it a little bit above the five mark so we've got plenty of room to cut. Burnish it down. And then I'm gonna put this white, which we don't need that much. I'm just gonna trim it off. Cause y'all, these are like teeny, teeny weeny tiny. And this one's gonna need to go a little bit above that 10 inch mark. So we're just gonna I love right this there. hack, by the way. If you, okay, if you, this, if you're like, I wanna become a pro, just do this. Yeah. <laughs> just this will like, save you so much time. This will time. save you so much time cutting vinyl or cardstock or anything like that. Truly. Okay, and then in design space, we're going to hit continue. We're using our Explore 3 today, and we're gonna be cutting this on premium vinyl removable mats. Keep it at default pressure. You're just gonna need that fine point blade. And we're gonna go ahead and load this into our machine. Make sure yes. it's under those little let lips, and it's gonna Scan the mat and then cut it. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, right? Now, it, this is such a fun project. I just want to let you guys know this is totally doable if you are, you know, nervous or, you know, excited and you are like, oh my goodness, I really want to rock this. Like, this is the, you know, a great beginner resin project and vinyl. Like, right. you're gonna feel super confident using your vinyl. You're gonna feel super confident using our fonts and yes. the resin. Like, it's gonna come together so good. This is like a good practice your skills project. Yeah. It's also a really good scrap buster because yes. we can use a ton of scraps for a this. A ton of scraps. Okay, so that's cutting. Um, and then we're just gonna weed it and apply. It. And y'all, that's it. So awesome. Super easy. I'm gonna go ahead and cut some transfer tape so we've got it ready. And these shouldn't take but a minute to weed. And then we're gonna get right into resin. So does anybody have questions about what we just went over? Because I know we kind of went over a lot. I tried to break it down and slow it down for you guys, but I know sometimes a lot of things get missed and I'd love to answer any questions. I did not do an offset on Courtney's name, Kelly, but that's a great hack. If you're using a very thin font, you can add an offset and then delete the original text and just cut the offset. So it makes your font like a little bit thicker. I didn't do that, but I could have. That's a good, good question. Yeah. Um, Katie says, I confess I haven't used my Cricut in quite a while. Seems like I have to relearn the software. No, they've made a couple updates. Um, but if you get inside our membership, we have a 30 days to master your Cricut. We have our Cricut reference guide in there. There's so many good tools for you to help you kind of refresh. Um, which I think is important for anybody, even if they are regularly using their Cricut, you always need yes. to be refreshing your knowledge. Exactly. Okay, so I'm just gonna weed these. Just got a standard weeding tool here. And this is the really dainty Courtney one, so be super mm -hmm. careful. And there's a couple tips that you could do when you are, you know, weeding that. Like I burnish my vinyl before weeding yeah. all the time. You could apply transfer tape and reverse weed it. There's a few different things, you know, you can have up your sleeve that we teach in our 30 day challenge book. So if you have not bought your year membership, definitely grab your year membership. I'm seeing so many of you say yes, so welcome everyone. We're yeah. so excited to have you. Um, to spend a whole year with us. Such a great commitment to your crafting. A lot of people question like, should I be a member if I am a hobbyist? Should I be a member if I wanna sell? Should I be a member if I'm a full-time crafter? Um, all the the answer is to all of this <laughs> is yes. And for those of you who are like, oh, there's nothing that they can't teach me, right? Like I've already learned it. What I want to say to this is, you know, each month we come to with new master classes and mm -hmm. just being around the community of like-minded crafters is well worth the investment. Um, plus the files, plus the fonts, like you're going to get so much value out of this community um, as long as you show up and participate. So Absolutely. we love it. So I yay. It. Okay, so I'm going to grab this first Lauren. <gasps> okay, Ooh. we're going to do a little layer in here. Yeah. I'm grabbing the first Lauren. And then we're just gonna take it and I'm gonna kind of apply it offset to this other Lauren to give it some depth, burnish it down. And then we're gonna take it off, okay? Yeah. And then we're just gonna add this to our little sparkly Yay. thing here. I See how much better it. that shows up, y'all? So good. Um, if you are not a member, you can get our lowest price, 75 off today using the code 75OFF. 
the year membership is we have over 500 files released every month we have over 20 fonts released every month we have a library of 20,000 files we have a library of a thousand fonts we have over a hundred classes you can take on demand we have our 30-day master your cricut challenge available at your own pace and so much more seriously after we make the project we'll show you around the membership yes um but it is incredible all look, right look how so good, good that fits oh oh no i yeah. burnished it too hard you guys uh oh uh -oh. okay Be a little bit less aggressive yeah we're just gonna lay it back down burnish it and then remove Woohoo! Go that Alicia. transfer. Hold on, she's wanting to stick because I was a little bit too aggressive. Yeah. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look how pretty that pink is. So those are the two Yay. we just made. How easy was that, y'all? Yay! Oh my, this I would be a great it. joy project, Lori. So fun. Okay, so there's those two. Let me show them close up, and now we're gonna jump right into resin, you all. Okay. Ooh, are we jumping in? We're jumping in. Resin time. Okie dokie. So I'm gonna set everything. This aside. is a perfect joy or joy extra project. Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely. Okay, so we are just. This is what we're gonna be making. I'm just gonna leave it there, so you guys can kind of have it in plain sight. Yep. Um, I'm going to be using this J Diction UV resin and I'm going to go ahead and put some gloves on. Mm -hmm. We're going to need this. So we're going to need this. I've got my UV light in on hand, ready to go. And I want to say this is the... Alicia, throw, yes. throw me this. How much... This one? Oh, I'm throwing you a question. Oh. <laughs> I, I, was, I was meaning, I'm going to throw you a question. You're okay. going to throw me an I'm answer. <laughs> So dingy Tell sometimes. me. No, it's literally me, not you. <laughs> also, y'all, you're talking about me getting more sleep. I did get more sleep than last night, and I just got a second coffee. I had no <laughs> idea how many, like, a just second coffee solves so much. It really Anyway, <laughs> tell me this. Say I'm brand new. Okay. I want the light. I want a bottle of your resin. Yes. And I want some molds. Okay. How much? Like it's not, it's, I would say under $60. Oh yeah. Like I would say 40 yeah. to $60 can get you started with resin. Get you a couple mm -hmm. basic molds. Yes, but you're gonna make a lot of projects with that too, which right. is pretty impressive. And buy you something that's like small, like the Stanley Toppers is a good starter so or like true. a keychain mold. So true. Keychains always are gonna sell y'all. Yep. Keychains are a good bet. So love something it, love small, it, it. you don't need anything crazy. You can use an actual lighter. You don't have to use a blowtorch. Um, so you have some of this stuff already. Okay, so to start, we are going to put down a layer of resin. So I've got my gloves on, I've got my UV resin right here. And all we're gonna do, and I'm using this mold over here. I'm sorry it's clear. I wish that you all could see it better. I'll try to hold it up. Um, but what I'm gonna do is put down a pretty thin layer here, okay? And we're just gonna use our popsicle stick to smudge it around, okay? Now they do have like resin colorants and things like that to, that you can use, um, but these look so cute clear. Can I feel you like. use anything other than the UV light? And the answer is yes. The beautiful sunlight you uh -huh. can use. So if it's sunny outside, you can use that. Unfortunately, here in East Tennessee, we cannot rely on that only. Right. Um, so we have the light. So it's always loyal. I love or if you craft at night. Or if you craft at night. Right. Hey, 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 hey. The so sun good. is my favorite, though, honestly. It really is. Yeah. Okay. And then sometimes, if you go to camera one, y'all, I have to act literally get down here and you can see if you've missed little spots. Like I can see that I need to kind of move my resin over a little bit. And like y'all can't see it from your angle, but if you're working with resin, you'll be able to see it so much better if you get down here at eye mm -hmm, level. Mm -hmm. And then now that it's smoothed out, I'm gonna take my butane lighter yep. and I'm just gonna turn it on and literally so fun. that's it so it's fun. like you're just going very quickly Ooh. and then we're gonna go ahead and get our flowers out I'm just gonna yeah. sit this here so Aw, oh, Nina says, I'm so glad that I'm not the smartest person I know. With that said, I purchased the year, and for the monthly cost to hang out with like-minded people was the same as I pay for two coffees. No brainer. Y'all, yep. I say it all the time. I, It's such, you're so, like Nina, you were right. 
Like you're hitting it on like the head on the hammer, like yes. you're in the nail, like you got it, like exactly. That's like what we, we can mean. inform you and give you all the files. Our team can curate everything for you and you just get to benefit from it all for I the cost it. of two coffees. What? 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 And you can just make the coffee at home for those reasons. Right. Love it. Okay, so I've got some tweezers here. I'm just adding in, I'm picking the flowers that So I for like. our newbies, how much resin do you use? Do you fill it all the way up? Do you not halfway? I would what say do you like, like to say? A quarter for the first layer. Yeah. Just, but you want to cover the bottom surface. So right. you need to cover it, okay? So you want to make sure to cover it. Um, but it also doesn't need to be full because we're going to be putting some, we're stacking layers here. Yes. Okay, so we're going to be putting a few different layers on. Oh, these flowers are so pretty. I think I want to use like this little Shasta daisy right mm -hmm, here. Mm -hmm. Look how adorable. I just, I'm a sucker for dried flowers. It's like one of my favorite, I think. I don't know. It's just one of my favorite things of all time. And then that one's kind of pretty, but it's a little big. These red ones are kind of pretty too. Ooh, I don't know. It's not fitting the vibe. Yeah. Okay. So are there discounts going from monthly to yearly? So Jeannie, if you do the math, you will save over a hundred dollars going from monthly to yearly. Plus you get the craft tag handbook. So if you are monthly, I do think it's the best time of the year to upgrade. If you do it by three o'clock today, you will be getting a super, like an extra gift, just because I feel like there's energy in this room today that there's people here that's like been following us for a while. Like if you've been following us for like years, I'm talking years and you love hanging out with us, but you've never wanted to enroll or you felt like it was impossible or impossible for you, I really want to invite you to like believe in yourself say yes to membership today. I would love to have you. We're going to hook you up with $75 off. You're going to get the craft tech handbook and a special gift, but you have a very limited time. So you've got to go enroll. Cannot wait to get you this, this, these gifts. Um, there's very few times that we have enrollment where you get a mailed to you goodie. Um, yeah. so if you are a year member already and you're like, Tanner, I want a free goodie. You can go to makersandlearn.com slash hacks. Sadie will drop that for you you can take a 2025 Makeathon ticket, which is awesome. It's the it's for next so year. So much fun. You're gonna get a supply box, or you can go ahead um, and go ahead and grab a, let's see what else is there. You can get, if you wanna learn how to sell, you can get Inner Circle, which is our full program teaching you how to make and sell your crafts. I actually coach in there, and our team coaches, our designers, we have a community manager that coaches in there. It's so good. So there's a lot of different programs. Make Maker University, Makers Will Sublimate, all of that will get you the Craft Tech Handbook this week. So yay! I love it. 150 okay. 150 spots left, y'all. 150. Less well, than that now. Yeah, they're going. Crazy. My claw cakes. Okay, so these are. This is my design. It's a little different from this one. Um, but you know, you can do whatever you want. Yeah. And then we're gonna turn our UV light on, and I like to hold it directly over it. And this usually takes like three to four minutes depending on how strong your UV light is it's really not um and so I'm just gonna hold it pretty close you yeah. can actually like sit <gasps> it on there Wendy says as a member is there a place to ask for help or advice using the Cricut and crafting Wendy yes our member two places our member only Facebook group is the best place and mm -hmm. here's why we have amazing moderators. We call them VIMs. Such a great group. If they're oh here, give us a shout out. They're amazing. So many great friends in that community. We also have so many fellow members where you can ask, and it's such an uplifting, positive community, as you can imagine. Over 10,000 amazing crafters and souls in that community that you could get mm -hmm. resources and advice from. We're in the group. And the second place is you can email us directly, hi at makersgonnalearn.com. So either yes. one, we will get you support so super super awesome and actually carol one of our vims that we were just preaching yes. about hey carol hey carol we love carol she uh, mentioned that you need to get clear resins when you're working with uv resin so if you did casting resin you can use whatever color molds but with uv resin you have to have that direct uv rays in order for it to cure fully meaning it needs to harden and if it doesn't have the UV rays touching it or getting to it, it's not gonna harden. So if you try to use UV resin in like a purple or a blue or a red mold, it's not gonna work. It has to be a clear mold. So this, obviously this mold is clear. Um, it looks like it's covered in glitter, but the mold is glittery. Like the actual mold is glittery. 
Um, so yeah, you're gonna want to make sure to do that. And then what I like to do is take my stick. Y'all, it's hardened. It's like magic. I love it. It's, <laughs> it's so crazy. Good. It's crazy. And then, so what I'm going to do now, so this is what it looks like so far, okay? I'm not yeah. going to take it out of the mold, but you can see the flowers like are still kind of sticking out, but they're pressed down enough into the resin that we can love seal it. them in. So we're just going to take this resin and we're going to go yeah. over top of all of this, okay? And pretty much, it. Fill it, pretty much fill it all the way to the rest of the top, okay? So love I'm going to try to be like consistent in my distribution of the resin just to make this more clean because resin can get like lumpy and gross if you're not if you don't have a yep. good like touch to it so i'm gonna exactly some resins are self-leveling which is amazing and some are not it just depends on what your resin says this one is like 50 50. Love i don't it. feel like it's completely self-leveling right 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 even if it said it was i don't know that it says it is but mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then i'm just getting the eye level like i said before yes and spreading this out. We want to make sure that our flowers are covered because if you do try to wash this and the flowers are sticking out. Oh, they out, have like, to be covered. Yeah, they have to. Yep. Or it's going to get ruined. So I'm just spreading this out. Now, if you accidentally go up on the edges at all, we have sandpaper in here so we can sand down the edges, which sounds crazy, but it works great. <laughs> when I first started doing resin, I was like, you sand it? That's yeah. weird. But it works really Love good. It. And I can actually put a little bit more on here, but what I'm gonna do is smooth this out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take my torch, cure it, and then do the third layer after I've cured it. Love it. Okay. I just, thin, in my opinion, when you do thin layers, it just works better. Um, like curing multiple layers. If you try to do it too thick and cure it, it won't cure sometimes. So right. you've gotta really, Pay good attention. Okay. I'm going to sit that right Any there. UV lights will work. It just depends on the stronger the light, the less time it's required. So yes. just think about that when mm -hmm. you're making a decision on that. How many nameplates can you make with that size resin bottle? Oh, gosh. Brianna, you could probably oh. make 20. Oh, at least. At least. At least. At least. Like it's with not much size. at all. Yep. <laughs> with yeah. this size, listen, the limit does not exist. Yeah, you can make it's so a many. lot, a lot. I'm going to actually cut um, a name for this so I can show Ooh. you all how to apply a name to the resin one. Yes. So let's just, we're just going to recut um, Courtney's name. Okay. Because you're going to do the same exact thing if you were laying out names right. for this one. So we're just going to go in here and delete that. We're going to go to make it mm -hmm. and then hit continue. We're still using um, just permanent vinyl. I'm gonna use some of this scrap vinyl that we have in here. And it's nice because while it's curing, you can cut your words out. So it makes Yay. it really easy. And I think that Y is gonna be okay on here. Mm -hmm. mm. Let's use purple. And yes, if you're registered for bootcamp, you have the full supply list with the files. So this resin is linked for you guys. Yes. Okay. Yay. So we are just doing the same thing we did earlier. I'm using a purple resin to send through our Cricut. Yep. And then let's check and see if this is cured. I'm just using the same, yeah. So it's good. It's already hardened. I wow. love it. It's incredible. It goes so fast. And then I'm just going to take my gloves. We're going to add that top coat. And that really should be it, y'all. That should seal it in. Yep. Okay. We're just squeezing. Look at that. And this is going to be our top layer. Okay. Take this. Get it eye level. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you can even take your popsicle stick and kind of scrape it. So it's, that's a good tip. Yeah, it like smooths it out, especially if you filled it all the way to the top. Right, 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 right. I like sometimes even like take it and like kind of like not beat it, but like let it fall on the like to try to level it out, and then use the uh, lighter to like get all the air bubbles out. Yes. I mean, this is a fun craft, y'all. Like this is so good, it so is. so good. I love it. Um, so if you all are going to be, if you all have never tried resin before, I want to put, I want you to put a 
heart emoji. Ooh. I want to know who is here and has never tried resin. Yeah, Drop a heart let emoji. Us know. I would love to know. We'd love, love, love to know. Okay, and I'm just filling in any holes that might be there. Mm -hmm. And y'all, if you start and you're like, oh, mine didn't turn out good the first time, y'all, resin is something that you really kind of have to work at. But it's not hard. Mm -hmm. But they're just things that you have to learn to make it work right. So yes. make sure you're following instructions on the bottle. Make sure you're following these tutorials to a T in yep. order to get the results that you're wanting. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. And then we're just going to cure this last layer. Yay. While that's curing. Welcome, Robin Smith. I just joined. Can't wait to learn. Yay. Yay. Welcome, I love welcome. It. Okay. Let's weed our word while we're waiting for that to cure. And you, I have a ton of dried flowers left over, and like you can buy those on Amazon and Timu and wherever. Okay, we're just gonna weed this, put some transfer tape over it. So fun. I love it. So it's kind of like an accent color, so it should stand out pretty good on yeah. those pink flowers. Mm -hmm. Does anyone have questions about? resin they're dropping lots of hearts lots and lots of hearts oh a lot gosh. of newbies are gonna be crafting with resin we're so excited <laughs> welcome wendy so good y'all love it love it love it love it love it love it mm. okay and then i'm still using that same transfer tape reduce genie yay welcome 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 upgraded from monthly to yearly woohoo y'all are awesome so much fun getting to craft with you guys today oh my gosh i love it so we're just gonna peel that off. Yeah. And then let's see if it's cured. I don't like to touch it with my hand because it leaves fingerprints. Would you recommend this as a first time resin project? Yes, we totally would. Definitely. How long does the resin last shelf life after it's open? Ours lasts forever. I mean, not ever, but like it's, it's some, if you, depending on the brand you buy, sometimes they can like yellow and mm. it's like they last, but they color. Uh -huh. um, How long would you confidently say? A year. A year. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. So, okay. That should be fully cured. Let's pull it out and see. If for some reason you pull something out of a mold and it's not cured, like I can tell this is a little bendy still. Uh -huh. So that's giving not cured to me. Right. Um, like it's still, do you guys see how it's mm -hmm. bendy? It's not fully cured. So let's just pop it back in. Yes. Just pop it right back in. And we're going to cure it a little bit more. Okay. Ooh. And it's probably that first layer, to be honest, I may need to take it out and like cure it on the counter. Mm -hmm. um, because I put that first layer in and then I put those flowers on it. So the UV light's not able to get to the underneath parts of the flowers as easily. So, um, Deb says I like to dry my own flowers. Yes. Oh my gosh, how fun would that be? Like handpicked love it. dried flowers. Oh my gosh. Ooh, so much fun. I love it. So once we pull this out, sometimes there's little ridges and that's what we're gonna use our sandpaper for. We just get this 220 grit sandpaper and I'll literally just tear off like Not a little piece. Not even much at all. No, it'll like, I mean, you get like, I don't know, like 12 pieces in a pack. Yeah. And we've linked all the supplies. If you're not signed up for boot camp, this is the one week out of the year, one of the weeks out of the year that you have to go ahead and just sign up for, um, for free. Mm -hmm. We are twing with doing like a paid cricket boot camp sometime later in the year where we learn like a lot of fun cricket skills, but this one's free. Mm -hmm. So all you have to do is sign up for your email and then you'll get the supply list with all the links to the molds, all the files for free, everything. So good, love okay, it. This is what it looks like before I sand it. So it looks a little wonky, okay? It's like the edges are very rigid. Yes. And you can see there's like pieces on it. So what we're gonna do is just take this sandpaper and lightly sand our edges, okay? Yes, it's looking awesome. So cute. And then you can add the vinyl mm -hmm. and put a layer of resin over top of that as well if you want. Right. Also be very aware of sanding the pointy edges. Like this is where it fills in the Stanley Cups. You don't want to sand that down. Right. 
but you do want to sand off the excess. And you use the torch on each layer of the yes. resin. Yeah, someone asked if it's only the first. It's each layer to make sure there's no bubbles or anything like that. Yes, I used it on every. So much fun. Can you put the name before the last layer of resin? Yes. yes that's what we'll do. Yeah, we will. I'm gonna put it on there and then we will, we'll just pop it back in the mold. Yeah. And then um, seal it in. So this purple is just what I had in here. I know that that's the, my number one choice. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. I like how you're giving so many options. Like if you just want to make this, you could order, you know, the done for you ones and just add vinyl. Right. Things like that. We wanted to have options because a lot of people don't like to work with resin. It's can be very finicky. Yes, exactly. I put my C too close to the edge and now my <laughs> vinyl's messing up. Give me, please hold. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know what? I'll just cut the T off for now. Core. No worries. We really cut it off. <laughs> Love it. Could you use Maker's Magic to seal vinyl instead of a la another layer of resin? Janice, you could. Um, that's what I would probably do if I didn't have the resin. If I do have the resin, I would totally use the resin. The resin is just going to cure better, more professional. It's going to be the better quality look. Um, but it's nice to have other tools in our tool kit. Wendy, yes. we were saying after opened, you would, um, uh, we would say you have about a year of working time. Uh, yeah. Love it, love it, love it, love it. So fun. Okay, so we're just, I'm putting like a light layer over the top of this. So for our tumbler, it's a 40 ounce tumbler. Mm -hmm. So that's the one we're working with today. Love it. I'm just gonna push this to the edges. So you really don't need like a thick layer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're just filling it in. We're using a 220 sandpaper. Yes. Beautiful. I feel like everyone's been super pumped about this. I'm loving it. Me too. I hope that you all are inspired to try resin. It's just such a fun craft. Yeah, this is gonna be such a great one for you to try resin, guys. So yeah. fun. It's an interesting yeah, we way love to use your Maker's cricket. Magic as a sealer too. So oh yeah, so much fun. Okay, and then we will cure that. Yeah, I'm going to run the lighter over it. Yay. Always get the lighter on it. So go on Always here. need the lighter. Always. Mm -hmm. You really do like three or four passes. You really don't need that much. And that's, that's all. That's so much fun. Phyllis says the more you work with resin, the easier it is. I 100% yep. agree. Um, and yes, storing it out of light is a very good point. Project is either buying the mold or making it or buy the pre-made. Correct wanted to give you guys some different options. Yes. Audrey, you could hold the um, light under the mold. It doesn't go through as strong as like you would think it mm -hmm. does, but it does mm -hmm. reach it to some extent. Yeah. It's not gonna cure it as fast as it is with me like putting it right over top. Will it help to put the lamp underneath the mold? That's what... Um, Sorry, yeah, dang it, I was reading right. the comment and you're reading it too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. I think it definitely just put it yes. on top. Is the flame touching the resin? It can. We, yeah. I mean, it totally can. Like, it's not. You're not gonna burn your resin. I wish that you all. It really. You can really notice it with casting resin because yes. when you spin it, it gets bubbly, and then when you pour it, there's so many bubbles, and then you they pop. Like as you heat it up, they just yeah. pop, burst. Um, but UV resin, you don't really have as much of an issue. Love it. Let's test. Oh, yay. Welcome to everyone. If you are just joining the year membership today, it's one of the best days to join. We have that special Act Now bonus. Um, yes. You have until the, you know, later on this evening. So go ahead. I am going to take good care of you. So yeah. go grab it while you can. We'll get you Here the Craft Hack Handbook. We're going to give you $75 off. It is the best time to join. <gasps> Alicia. All done. Bring, bring the Stanley over real fast. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Look, Guys, I mean, come on. Should we show them overhead? Yeah, we show them overhead and how yeah. it doesn't even touch, like, you know, when you're drinking. Oh my gosh, like, it's so oh, cool. Oh, I love it. Look, so it's just, isn't that so fun? Yay! So I love good. it. 
so, so, so good. And it does hover a little bit, but that's, it's like, it looks good. Yeah. Too, so cute. I love that. Yes. I literally love this so much. What did you guys yes. think of today's project? Oh, so much fun. So good. Anytime anyone buys a Cricut, I recommend your website. Martha, you Aww, guys are so sweet. Thank, thank you, you, thank you, thank you. We love getting to craft with you guys. Now remember, just by commenting today, you're entered to win an amazing, um, amazing special gift, ooh. which is a hundred dollar gift card to Amazon. And you can all get right? all of your resin supplies. Yeah. I love yes, it. Yes, 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 yes. So it is so good. I love it. Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone that's joining. Where are the gloves you told us you were mandatory? I did a resin project when without gloves. What a mess. <laughs> so I took them off for like the last layer because yeah. I was weeding vinyl. Yeah, so but where, funny. Where are your gloves, so everybody? Funny. Okay, so I signed up with Monthly. What happens next? Do I go anywhere else or I'm ready to go? So if you signed up for Monthly, you're ready to go. You can just yeah. start enjoying the website. You get mm -hmm. unlimited downloads. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. So exciting. Yeah. And we love it. So we already announced the giveaway winner from yesterday. Mm -hmm. You just have to comment to be entered to win the resin gift card or the Amazon, the Amazon. gift card <laughs> to use whatever you want. I would buy resin with mine. Me too. Because it's such a fun class. We'll announce the winner at the top hour for uh, tomorrow. So that's yes. how we do it. We want to make sure that we hold space for anyone that is working, unavailable to be here during the day. Right. So much fun. But I know there are people here that are meant to join the membership and I want to give you our first book for free. There's something <laughs> special about getting the Makers Glorian first book for free. And yeah. Alicia, I don't know if you've got to see yet, we have our names right here. All of our names, so special. all of our names right here. It is so, so special to me. So fun. I am so excited to not only hook everyone up with this book, mm -hmm. but the course. Oh my gosh, the course is like it what is really going to be like watching Netflix, just watching each category. There's 12 categories. Yes. We'll talk about those for a second. So we have Cricut, yeah. mm -hmm. Design Space, Vinyl, Heat Transfer, Specialty Material, Print Then Cut, Text and Fonts, General Crafting, Paper Crafting. Hot glue, hot glue hacks. dollar store, mm -hmm. and organization. You can't beat it. Y'all, this is everything you need. It's like your manual to crafting. Mm -hmm. And this is all of our best tips and tricks as being advanced crafters yes. from the world of Cricut, implementing it in a course and into the book. Yes. I love so, it. You need to grab your year membership. You're getting a special goodie when you sign up while we're still on air. So don't walk run. Yes. I am so excited. I've had some questions of people asking like, if I have a year membership, if it renews, what do I need to do? Okay. A couple options. You can go to makersgoodlearn.com slash hacks and you can find out what other program you would like to add to get this $197 course and book for free. Yes. If you want to add a 2025 Makeathon ticket, mm -hmm. that will get you this for free. You can add a year of membership, this for free. Yep. You can purchase any of our other programs, Maker U. Mm -hmm. You can grab Maker's Gonna Sublimate. All of the deals on that page, I asked them to put the lowest price possible. <laughs> okay, so there's deals. All the deals all are day. to celebrate National Craft Month. Right. Okay, I love it. so add something this week and you're gonna get this. We have them all coming in, the books. Mm -hmm. We're shipping them out. We're packing them. We're gonna have a packing party yes. probably on Tuesday next week, I okay. think maybe the live. That's I don't know. That's gonna be so fun. It'll be so special to me. Yeah. Um, just to get to pack up our first book. I know. Send out to you guys. So fun. And we only have a hundred and probably 20 left. We've had a lot, a lot. A lot of people of books signing get up. Claimed. So while we're still on air, you'll get that special gift. I wanna welcome Kirsten, Tamala, Margaret, Jeannie, Wendy, Robin, Mary, Sandra, Jessica, Latasha. Thelma, Mary, Brenda, Mary, Shelly, Jasmine. I mean, so many people. Can't even count them all. All right. Somebody so, was asking about when the course is. Okay. So that's a great question. So we have a couple of things that we're coming out with this month. Yes. We have our Craft Hack Handbook course launching. Right. We have this being shipped. Mm -hmm. We have Sadie's font pairing <gasps> that is going to be coming out very soon. Everyone's been super pumped Ooh. about that. Yeah. So it, when you become a member, you get the member resource library. Mm -hmm. Would you show them Absolutely. the dashboard real fast? Yes. Just so that they know where it'll end up being for I would everyone. Love to. It is so much fun. Okay, so this is, we were on the fonts. Real but quick, any customer care, as I've addressed multiple times today, this is not the place for your customer service. This is our fun time, right? Mm -hmm. Customer service is an intimate thing that you deserve the best quality service, and I want to make sure you get it. Yeah. How do you get that quality service? You email 
hi at makersgonnalearn.com and my team's ready to serve you, all right? So, so good. Absolutely, okay, so on the website, um, you're just gonna go, you're gonna log in and it's gonna take you straight to this page. So you're gonna go right into your dashboard. When you become a member, you get access to your own special dashboard. And everything here is everything that you need to master your cricket. okay? So we were talking about, um, we were talking about resources, that's what you wanted me to show them? Yeah, well you just show them the dashboard and just show them like- The different areas. The different areas, yeah. Okay, so this is the resources and Lauren, you'll hear her say, this is one of her favorite parts of the web Website, and I agree with that because this is like the dark horse of our website. I think a lot of people don't refer to this page, um, but y'all, everything you need in here, this is first of all, this is where you should go first. Okay? Yes. Master your cricket. The book is right here. You can print this out. And the course portal is under courses. You get it yes. for free. And so there's this videos. is the book. Yeah, there's yeah. a video per day too. Right. So this is the book. This is going to take you. 30 days, you can do it in a week, you can do it in two nights if you're really crazy. Yep. But y'all, all of these right here have videos. It's gonna show you how to weed, all the way to how to make a sticker and master 3D cut right. files. And y'all, this is just the bread and butter. This is where you want to go first thing. I like. I don't even want you all to ask questions in the Facebook group until you went through this book. Yeah, it's a firm foundation. Mm -hmm. um, so just watching the, we show them under the courses, just like each. Where the thing yeah. is, yeah. We go okay. to courses. And Let's then go to our dashboard, dashboard again. Yes. And then right here is where you would find the classes for the 30 days to master. Yeah. It is and so I heard good. someone say they'd been a member for a couple of years and they didn't know that we had that. And I was Ooh. like, go take it right now. Go, I was like, don't you walk, have to. run. Yes. yes. Run, okay. run, run. Let's scroll down. There it is. Okay. So Ooh. when then you click on this and all these videos are under it's here. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. beautiful Look at beautiful. it. We have a welcome page yes. and then all of these like design space Guys, tips. I mean, come on. So each day is its own training, and this is exclusive mm -hmm. to the course portal. Like you do not get this anywhere else. It is right. self-paced. So yeah. some people get through this curriculum in, gosh, I mean, four or five days is a lot of people's testimony. Yeah. If you're a beginner, you're gonna get more value because you can, you know, take all 30 and take it slower. Right. So love it's it, so love it, love it. And then we also have all these other places. So if you're ever curious about the commercial yep. lessons, you can look here. We yes. have all of our master classes we have ever done are located yes. here. We do a master class every single month, mm -hmm. exclusive to members only. Yep. And then we've got a Facebook group that is extremely active. So active. Always, people are always posting in there. And then you can just get your cut files and fonts. And then we've got this beautiful calendar over here. Look, if we click on tomorrow, yes. it's gonna tell you our class for tomorrow. So you yeah. can always see what we're gonna Going to be doing for the next day. Yep. So super helpful. If you're a member, you are automatically enrolled for the class on Sunday. If you sign up mm -hmm. for boot camp, you're automatically enrolled on the class for Sunday. Great question. Yeah. But yeah, you do want to grab that membership so we can get you the Craft Hack Handbook. If you enrolled yesterday, you do get the Craft Hack Handbook. Yes. Wendy asks, is there a course to download and add fonts to the Cricut? Yes. You need to get in the membership and take the 30 days to master your Cricut yeah. course. That is one teach, of the core classes. We teach you how to work with your fonts, mm -hmm. how to use them. We teach yeah. you how to the relationship between the you know our website design space yes, and, how, and to, like, how, it how it works really oh, yeah. slow and we tell you everything yeah. all the details so good yeah um this will be available so what we've done is if you're an active member you can grab this for 50 percent off for 97 the course in the book or you can buy any of our other programs and you get it for free can't beat it. Can't beat it. Can't so beat we it. just love hooking you guys up with this. That offer yeah. will not be available forever. So you do want to walk, not run. Yes. Um, you want to run, not walk. <laughs> I love it. I'm crazy. I'm I was crazy. like, yeah, that sounds right. Yeah. So Ellie, I'm trying to sign up and it appears that it comes up higher. So Ellie, you will just want to go ahead and select yearly, type in the coupon code 75OFF. Mm -hmm and then you'll be able to lock in. And that rate you get to keep forever. All right, you grandfather in, lowest rate, best deal possible. If you need intimate, like one-on-one -on -one customer service, send us an email, hi at makersgonnalearn.com. We'll hook you up, okay? Yes. So fun. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for you guys. Yeah, now when you sign up, for the next couple of hours, you're getting a special little gift from me, just mm -hmm. from me to you, because I feel like today's energy is just so good. Yeah. I just want to welcome as many people as possible Absolutely. into the community, um, which we love seeing you guys. Like, here's the deal. You've invested in your cricket, right? right. 
Now you need to invest in yourself mm -hmm. to be the best steward of your Cricut machine. Absolutely. Right? You know how to design, you know how to work, you know how to use it. Mm -hmm. When you take our training courses and our files and fonts will help you do that yeah. in addition to our edu education, right? Yes. Our three pillars, we want to inspire you mm -hmm. to want to create, right? Because if you don't, if you're not inspired, if you don't want to, you're not going to do it, right? right? So then from there, we're going to motivate you to really understand why, mm -hmm. right? Why you need to do this, how to do this, like give you the motivation and then the education. Like yes. that's the three pillars of our entire business that when you have all three, when you're inspired, when you're educated and you're motivated, you're going to have those three pillars that will take you to whatever goal you want to go after. All right. I love it. So fun. Gotta have that solid foundation, people. So good. So, love so it. good. So do we have any questions? If you have any, any questions, questions, bring them to like reiterate them. We have a lot of people here today. Yes. I am so excited to <gasps> see you guys. What's tomorrow's project? Um, tomorrow we're doing, in, we're mastering intricate cuts tomorrow. Ooh. So we dabbled in it today. Yeah. We're gonna be working with HTV instead of adhesive vinyl. Yay! So if you've never done a heat transfer vinyl, yeah. we're gonna be doing that. And we're gonna be talking about intricate cuts, which yep. a lot of people ask us about. So yep. I want y'all to be there for that. There's gonna be a lot of good information yes. and y'all are not gonna wanna miss it. Plus that project is like, so good. Really cute. So fun. Yes. If you pre-ordered this already, like earlier at the end of last year, you yours will be shipping out this month. We mm -hmm. literally, they just, like the trucks just brought them in, like box after box. Like Incredible. there's thousands. Like, yeah. so we've got it. So <laughs> yay. Brandy, we do not have an option to where if you do monthly, you get the book. This is a $197 course and book combo. That's why I invite you just for 150 spots left, like almost down to 100, yeah. you will get this for free. Right. Right. So on top of the $75 off, use the code 75OFF. You're getting $75 off. Mm -hmm. You're getting the books shipped to you, which is a huge cost on our part of manual labor, right. hours, and shipping and printing costs. Like it's expensive. Mm -hmm. um, just as a fun gift, just to celebrate with yes. you guys. Yeah, they're being sent out this month. So fun. So exciting. Do you have a print and cut? We have classes on how to troubleshoot and calibrate your print and cut. Oh, yeah, so Definitely many. check out that in the 30 day challenge. It'll I just did a print and cut hack. We're going to be doing it in April. I just figured it out I'm before so our excited. live stream. I'm so excited it's about very that. Cool. Yeah. Love it. So love fun. it. Love it. Love it. So cannot wait. Cannot wait to get you guys these books in your hands. Go ahead, register. We have such a fun time. Come back tomorrow. Yes. Mastering intricate cuts is something we all need to see. Absolutely. We all need to do. I do not want you to miss out on all of the goodness. Okay. All right. So good. What vinyl did you use? 651? Um, I used a Starcraft today. Yeah. Removable map. Yeah. Yeah. Ellie, you, so regular price of your membership is um, $270 for the year. Mm -hmm. When you use the coupon code, it's $75 off, which is why your price is now $195. Yes. So think about that. You're saving the um, $75 from $270. You're locking in that $195 today, mm -hmm. next year, and every year you stay a member. All right, Love it is so fun. It. So do not walk, Ellie. Run and finish your checkout so you get your special gift. Yeah. I want to get you locked in. So much fun, y'all. We love getting to craft with mm -hmm. you. I want to see these projects in the Facebook group. We better see them. We better see them. We em. saw the paper projects. I yes. want to see the resin projects. Yes, you'll have to order a few things, I'm sure. But yeah. um, try and play around with resin. Do a test project if you've had it and you're pulling it back out. Yes. Anything like that. Come back tomorrow. It is so good. If it's not allowing you to enter the coupon code, you may have selected monthly. Mm -hmm. So be sure you've selected yearly and use the coupon code 75 O F F, not zero. I was typing it in yesterday and I accidentally put the zero yeah. instead of the O. Right. So it's 75 O F F. Yes. Okay. So much fun. Love seeing you guys. If you need customer support, just email us. Yeah. Hi at makersgonnalearn.com. And we're super, super excited for you. All right. Love it, love it, love it. And again, we are just so excited to see you guys. I know. The it's email be so fun. for support is hi at makersgonnalearn.com. 
Is there a place to see how to put the shadow box? I'm trying to do the Easter Bunny with flowers. So Julie, you would follow along with the same training from yesterday for almost any of our other trainings. Yes. Um, and then you would just reference how we referenced ours for the other ones. Yes. Does that make sense? So you could use it's that gonna training. It's going to go exactly the same yeah. as yesterday. So good. And the grandfathered clause is this promotion is a great one. So if any of you are locked in at a different rate, you can grab this rate and get locked in at this one. You just have to say yes to another year, mm -hmm. right? So if you are locked in at a different rate, you can lock in the $75 off rate, right? right? And then that will become your rate. Yeah. And it's the lowest. So it's like our Black Friday deal. Yeah. And the way I like to explain it, like we talk about our promotions a lot more than other companies do. And I think they don't treat their people like their best friend. Yeah. <laughs> like here, we treat y'all like our best friend. We're like, just trying to give you a good We're deal. trying to make sure everybody's Taking got, care got the best. We yeah. want, our goal is to get you the most for the least. Right. And that's why you participate in these shows. We give you the most training, mm -hmm. you know, right? We want to give you all the value. So yeah. definitely grab that if you haven't already. If you need anything, customer service is available. Oh, Brandy, welcome. We love getting to serve oh, you guys. We, I don't want to toot my own horn, but toot toot. toot, toot. <laughs> Alicia always does that when I say it. It cracks me up. Um, we just show up and we just serve. Like my background is making like blog articles and I didn't really ever get to like know people. Yeah. Like having this YouTube channel, you get to know people's name. You get to oh, live yeah. stream. You get to serve. You get to craft. You get to oh, you know have it. a full little little show. It and fulfills my nurse heart. Yeah. For sure. It so fulfills good. that like caring, yeah. see, making relationships with people. Yeah. And I love it. That's it's like special. one of the things I love so much about my Yes, yes. Yeah. My previous job I didn't I had millions of views. I had millions of people on my website, but I didn't know their name. I didn't right. know who they were. They were like very inanimate. Yeah. Like here, it's just very um, personable we and, and we everybody. reach and we look, I'm so grateful and thankful that we have space to reach so many people. Yeah. Um, but we still get to like know you guys yeah. and like, you know, craft and things Our like friends, that. So I want to see you guys back here uh, tomorrow. I think we're probably one of the best places to learn your cricket. I would love to invite you to say yes to membership. And oh, it's so yeah. much fun. We are independent. Someone did mention that. We are not paid by any brand. Nope. In 2018, I stop pretty much working with any brand mm -hmm. as in like getting checks like yeah, you know a lot like of these a, a lot of these influencers and i address this quite often if they have a product before um a brand comes out with it one of two things are happening right first thing's happening is they're getting a check yeah for their review and i'm talking that's influencing I'm talking their opinion a, heavily yeah i'm talking a four to five figure check no shame in their game though. no no this is not a shame to their game i'm like i'm proud right. and i'm loud and proud Right? Like get that, get that, get bag. your check. I'm very happy get for you money. that I used to do it. That's the only reason I can say it. There's other influencers that will sit here and say, oh my gosh, I am not in like, I am not paid by them. Right. But they still got the product early. Yeah. So when that happens, they have a relationship mm -hmm. that could be an affiliate relationship right. or they could be benefiting from the brand, giving them the product early. And if you get the product early from the brand to help right. benefit your business You're or, gonna your, or your affiliate commission right. or any, fill in the gap, fill in whatever, there is a rapport and a relationship that is separate from the product. Right. And it's just hard. It starts getting really messy with, you know, the lines. And people get mad. People, it's just really hard to give honest opinions right. when, and holding companies to super high standards when there's other factors right. when the brought when the relationship isn't just how's the product and that's the beauty in what we do here and that's we the beauty of what we do here fully honest fully honest all and i just had to separate myself and step back and say i want to work directly for the people and that's the only person i want to solve for and help serve yeah. period no risk no reward point, point blank period <laughs> i work for you um so that's what you're going to see here that's what you um you know get to be a part of so if mm -hmm. you're new here I love having you. If you've been a fan for many years, know how grateful and thankful we are for you. Absolutely. Tomorrow, I mean, are y'all ready to master intricate crafts? I don't know if Are they are ready, ready, Alicia? I don't know. Y'all better show up and we will see. transfer vinyl. It's gonna be so yeah. good, all hey, right? Hey, hey. Email customer service if you have any questions. Hi at makersgonnalearn.com and we'll see you back here real soon. Bye, Bye guys.